Fourth of July celebrations are taking place all across South Florida today. In Miami Dade, lots of people spending the day out at Bayfront Park. CBS 4's Trish Christakis is one of those. She's at Bayfront with what you can expect if you're heading down there this evening. Trish. Yeah, Ted Carly, it really is a beautiful day. Not too bad in the shade. It doesn't feel too hot over here. And as you can see around me, everyone is already posting up, getting ready for those fireworks. Now, everyone that I've spoken to today is already thrilled to be out celebrating as this is really the first time they've been able to watch the fireworks out in public for a while since COVID. Take a look. Uh, this is the first real 4th of July in a couple of years. So we're glad to celebrate our country. This is the first time in a while, so thankfully. Crowds filling the streets this 4th of July, the first time many are able to celebrate and wear their red, white, and blues. <laughs> Had this shirt for two years. Couldn't wear it because of the pandemic. Celebrating the 4th in Miami is a tradition for some families, as many traveled from all over to watch the fireworks at Bayfront Park. Come down here just to see the fireworks because normally that's something that we do every year. You know, we leave from Ireland or come to Miami just to enjoy, you know, the nice weather and everything. If you're planning on making your way downtown tonight, Miami police are suggesting public transportation or ride share. If you choose to drive yourself, all paid parking downtown will be open. But if you plan to walk because you're staying downtown, Miami PD says they'll have extra officers at the event and surrounding areas. Right here, we're actually staying at the Intercontinental, so I think we're going to have a front row view, if I'm not mistaken. I Just a uh, chance to relax a little bit, get away from the hustle and bustle back in Richmond and uh, come and lay out and enjoy. That's what we're doing. And back out here in Bayfront Park, fireworks will start tonight around 9 p.m. You might want to get here early for a spot. As you can see right now, everyone is already getting that. Now, again, Miami police are suggesting most people take public transportation or a ride share. But if you choose to drive, all paid parking will be open downtown, but it is going to be busy. So again, you might want to get here just a little bit early. Live at Bayfront Park, I'm Trish Kristakis for CBS 4 News. Back to you guys.